Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing The Sims 4 again. As you can see, the gang war is over. <laughs> Last two episodes we were in a bit of a gang war. Oh, what the sh- Jesus Christ! But, uh, this is the leader mourning the loss of his last gang member, so... Yeah, that's... that's over. So yeah, this is a bit of a familiar sight, isn't it? One of these doors, the whole household will immediately become worried. <laughs> but yeah, I added an extra floor to this, uh, building. Unfortunately, I can't have basements, so I just stuck another floor on top of the whole thing. <laughs> Grim is still all messed up. Like, I don't know, is it just because they got married and they're starting to look like each other or what? But Grim used to look like the Reaper, if you've not seen that before, and well, now he looks like this. When I grow up, I want to be a ninja when I grow up. What do I need to do to- Get a ninja outfit, I don't care. <laughs> I should have said start practicing your hiding. <laughs> Just like, make sure I never see you again. Oh my god, he's so feckin' freaky. <laughs> oh my god, never take that off again. Okay, look, cancel. I, I can't deal with this right now. <laughs> we'll fix this another time. Extra food? The neighbors around here like to cook, so when they heard you hadn't had a substantial meal in a while, they decided to bring over some of the extra food. I don't want your charity. <laughs> what the shit is this? Kick him out. Yeah, that's right. Leave the food. <laughs> like, I don't want your charity, but I am kinda hungry. <laughs> but I'm still mad at you. <laughs> Next time, don't be rude like that. I'm gonna have some of that. That looks good. Santa, you're looking a little, uh, unwell there. Maybe you should go upstairs. Oh my god, Jim, that looks a bit unwell too. He just vomited all over the floor, but let's ignore that. Sorry to have missed you, but we'll be sure to bring my food if we have extra in the future. How many times do I have to teach you this lesson? Wish him. <laughs> He's like, what am I doing up here? <laughs> I didn't even know this place had an attic. Okay, very good. Now he's locked up there. Now we can begin to experiment. This is a proper bunker. Okay, he's still not worried at all. <laughs> he's just singing away. It's like, I'm in the attic. I'm not threatened or cold at all. Zombie apocalypse. Survival items. Purchase. Okay, we're gonna need to get you a radio, anti air infection mask, a first aid spray, a survival shotgun. <laughs> gonna get some 12 gauge rounds too. <laughs> Fucking hell. Cure serum. Oh, a virus serum. Nice. <laughs> Alright, listen to police emergency broadcast. Attention all citizens, there has been an increasing number of- What the hell? You were in the sand the whole time? Jesus Christ, that must have gotten everywhere. Uh, Grim, you didn't do a very good job. <laughs> There's been an increasing number of reports on individuals eating human flesh, cannibalism, from different spots in town. Please be cautious and try to stay inside. We're still unclear on if the events occurring are due to the recent laboratory incident, as we're still working on the case. Uh, Scooby, get inside. <laughs> this guy's just fishing out here. <laughs> I wonder if he'll get any- Bites. Oh, you're welcome. Just happy to make you laugh. <laughs> you must be in hysterics right now. Don't worry, Ryland's gone out to talk them down. Look how confident he is the way he's walking. I'll take care of this. Mean, rude introduction. Oh, he's realized what he's dealing with now. He's still trying to chat with her though. I didn't tell him to do that. Okay, well, he got bitten. Okay, well, he's running away now. <laughs> uh, Santa, you best get upstairs. Wait, who the feck opened this door? <laughs> Be very careful what you do here. He's turning into a zombie already. <laughs> what? Oh my god, they're eating him! Jesus Christ! I didn't expect this! I thought he'd gradually turn! Oh my god! <laughs> lock the feckin' door! I left her frozen out on the porch, but lock the door. Is everyone in the house? No, they're going outside. Can we- can we get inside, please? Stop trying to check chat with them. Jesus Christ, they're all gonna die. Locked door for everyone, all right? We're locking this place down. Can't be trusted. Great, now Santa's just roaming out on the beach. This is a zombie. God damn. He's still in my cult. <laughs> oh, she got unfrozen. What's she gonna do now? I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. Is she gonna get away? I don't think the zombies are really going for him. I guess they prefer fresh over frozen food. Unlock just for Jim. Wait, why can I not unlock for Jim? What? I don't- School is stupid, is that what you're worried about right now? <laughs> Society requires school for success. <laughs> Raises manners. Okay, phew, crisis averted. I love being a parent. Jim's gonna go out there and deal with this. They're probably specifically coming for Jim, but too feckin' bad. <laughs> I'm used to killing the living. <laughs> I don't mind killing the dead. I like how it says chat with her and it has the little gun symbol. Oh, I love having a chat with my friends. Jeez, they blew her head clean off. I like how he's showing as much skin as possible when he's out here fighting zombies. You're just gonna stare at her? You're gonna do something? Oh no, you're gonna run away. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> 
Okay. <laughs> the little success noise after killing all of them. All right, uh, Santa. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do with you. Like, I can't bring myself to put you down. It'll be like putting down old Yeller. Oh, Shrek came home. Oh, God, I'm sorry. <laughs> you came home to a shit show. Our attempt to convert this attic into something useful. Tragedy has struck, and we gotta do something about it. All right, let's get this whole thing ironed out, shall we? <laughs> he just built a science lab. He's like, I'm the man to fix this. <laughs> I know nothing about science, but I've seen the movies. He's mopping up the blood on the sand. Uh, guys, could you please move? <laughs> Jesus Christ, he's coming up behind you guys. All right, look, I don't want to say what happened or how he got in here, but you're gonna have to go in and deal with the problem, okay? <laughs> this is me solving the issue, okay? All right, now just stay in there a few seconds. Lock the door, lock the door. <laughs> okay, now do something. Make him stop being a zombie. Oh, he's feigning to be dead. Let's see if this plays out. <laughs> oh, I think it may have worked. <laughs> I think we may have solved the problem. We all just need to die, <laughs> and then they won't be after us anymore. Jim bought all this equipment, and then he realizes he doesn't know how to use it. <laughs> it's like only scientists can puzzle out how to use this. I got the zombie hunter trade, and I got five grand for his heroic actions. Wow. Oh, it looks like you're not a zombie hunter. You're not as cool as me, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sorry to hear that. <laughs> oh, that's the dear leader day. Yay. <laughs> I can't think of a better way to celebrate it. Maybe I should invite everyone over. Oh my god, look at that. That's so cool. <laughs> These mods are so well made. Everybody, come over. It's the dear leader day. The cult needs to gather. Good evening, my child. <laughs> it's kind of warm, so I'm going to stick to my swimwear, but you guys keep the robes on. First aid spray. Oh, they drop stuff. And a, and a gun. Oh my god, the poor guy. <laughs> oh god, he's getting eaten. Okay. <laughs> Just keep eating him. That, that's fine. All right, let's bring the cult up here. I like how he put on the robe, though. That's dedication to the cult. Even when he's dead, he knows who the real boss is. Okay, everyone. Thank you for coming on Dear Leader Day. <laughs> now, to show your true loyalty, follow me. <laughs> Very good. You've all passed the test. Oh. Well, there goes one. <laughs> I'll be on my way, thank you. She looks back at me like, uh, is this supposed to be happening? <laughs> Just lock that door. See what goes down. Hmm, yes, this is really helping my studies so that I can solve this zombie apocalypse. <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, singing helps me focus. D uh, ignore it <laughs> if you can. It's beautiful. <laughs> you hear the screaming in the background? <laughs> oh, there goes another one. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, but I reached singing level seven. Yay. Oh, God, there goes another one. He just walks away. He's very confused. He's like, how have I not solved this problem yet? <laughs> He's just like, I thought if I fed them enough, they'd just stop. <laughs> <laughs> Music that played. It always plays at the wrong time. <laughs> He's uh, looking at it under a microscope. He's desperately trying to figure this thing out. He probably thinks this is a gun. <laughs> Some kind of doomsday device. All right, maybe if I put in a cocaine brick with them, maybe that'll make him stop freaking out. Maybe they're just like uh, in withdrawals, like really, really hard. All right, our first test. Does cocaine fix being a zombie? <laughs> is it the cure? <laughs> we must find out. <laughs> this is a strange world. <laughs> I have a cult that I locked in my attic and made them turn into zombies and now they're doing cocaine trying to turn them back <laughs> says the former vampire mermaid <laughs> <laughs> all right well that did feck all okay i'm going downstairs it is dear leader day i don't want to waste my day with you guys if you're not socializing wait who are you oh you're grim sorry <laughs> i didn't recognize you with those socks covering like most of your legs at least we're out on an island like that that's one thing we locked out on like this is beautiful unless there's more people buried in the sand here <laughs> i like that it's official that in my house was actually built on a graveyard. This guy didn't come over, Valentino. I'm very disappointed. Like, if you want to be part of the cult, you're either in or you're out. You can't be, like, half in. I can't even call him. Where, Where is he? Is he dead or something? I gotta invite people over for Dear Leader Day. Oh, I need to air grievances. Okay, I need to shout at someone and give a gift. Give a Dear Leader Day gift. What, what can I give you? Oh, God, I've got a lot of rotten fish. You can have one of those. Oh, you have a gun. <laughs> oh, wait, a small print of me sticking on my middle finger. That's perfect. <laughs> you just open the box. It's a picture of me flipping you off. Erwin and Shrek now despise each other. What is going on? Why are you stomping on my sand? This is a good excuse to yell at you. Shout forbidden words at first name. Perfect. Uh, I wouldn't go up there if I was... You know what? You do you. Do what you want to do. Oh, yeah, I forgot that we're still technically... 
technically in the gang. He's like, <laughs> he's like, oh, the gang is trying to take over our turf. And I'm like, dude, I got a lot more important shit going on right now. How about you take over the gang? I escalated the war beyond repair. And now I'm leaving him take over. But I've got zombies in the attic. Like, there's a lot of shit going down. He's like, well, shit. <laughs> Look. Son, I'm gonna swear at you now because you beat up that bear. I can't get out of my mind lately. Wanna go on a date and get some lunch? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go. I don't even know who he is. It's a ghost. Probably can't get me out of his mind because I killed the fecker. You zombification virus on Carlo. Yeah, I mean, you did disrupt my day. I was just shouting swear words at my son. <laughs> I mean, he's a ghost. What will this even do? So far, not such a great date. Now insult him so that we can get the air grievances. Yes, very good. Now I just need alcohol, but I think I think this place only serves puffer fish and water, if I'm not mistaken. It is my restaurant, after all. I'm gonna fight him. I'm not sure how I could win against a literal ghost. Like, you'd think physical violence isn't the answer. But here we go anyway. <laughs> it is the day for it. I think he won. I guess that's no surprise. <laughs> they now despise each other. <laughs> wow, it took that? Really? I thought as soon as I infected you with a zombie virus that you'd hate me. Okay, well, I completed the air grievances thing. Can someone get me a drink? I think the restaurant may have closed down on account of the zombie virus thing, you know? Okay, these all just show up as drink. I'll just get this, and, and maybe this for him. I don't know what it is, but it doesn't look good. <laughs> oh, there's nothing in it when I cheat and get it from the buy menu. Feck! Alright, no alcohol for me, I guess, then. I would do anything for a line of coke right now. Wait, are you that guy? You're the guy I killed in my gang headquarters. No wonder you can't stop thinking about me. You just want cocaine. <laughs> That's right. Don't ever come here begging for coke. Uh, okay, I think I might have really messed him up. Look at him, he's Freaking out! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay, he just bit someone. <laughs> I just saw it just before I left. The whole neighborhood's fecked. I literally made a zombie ghost. Oh, he's a bit dazed. He's a little confused with what's been going on. <laughs> Could someone make me a drink, please? <laughs> Plan is social event. I just want to hire a bartender, that's all. All right, it, I made it a costume party, so everyone's dressing up. Wow, Shrek, that's a great costume. No one will even know it's you. <laughs> I'm just gonna set up a bar, like, right the entrance here so that we can make some drinks. Oh my god, she's not happy to be here. I can't tell if she's a cop or just dressed up. I don't know. I need some with alcohol. Was that rum? Rum and coke. Brilliant. A drink will help clear my mind and solve the zombie apocalypse. He's just drinking alone in this child's room. Okay, at least he's not as weird as her. Wait, what the hell? Who's this? First name is impersonating Grimm. I guess that's who he looks up to out of everyone in the house. I was like, Grimm's looking a bit chunky. Because <laughs> Grimm is really, really skinny. <laughs> Even the zombie's dressed up. That's brilliant. What do we got here? Oh, we just got normal clothes. We got an astronaut. We got another pizza boy. Wow. Wow. Wait, Dylan, what the feck are you doing up here? You, sh you weren't supposed to see this. Oh, he still loves me. Okay, he's probably like, wow, Jim is doing some good out here, trying to help all these people. <laughs> wow, he's so great. Jim can now practice fighting with other Sims just for fun. He's been doing that anyway. <laughs> it's just not been fun for them. This is a very different Sims game. <laughs> oh my god, this sounds so annoying like this. All right, I have this idea. I have this thing called Zombie Cure, and I'm going to try it. Okay, it worked. <laughs> wow, it's instant. All right, we gotta make sure this isn't temporary, so I'm gonna leave you in here and wish you the best. Well, that didn't last long. <laughs> I didn't even get out of the room before he got bitten again. He's like, I don't suppose I could treat you to a pizza instead of me. <laughs> I don't think they have any interest though. <laughs> nope. Not pizza, but thank you for the offer. All right, well, it looks like I'll need to put in some serious study <laughs> to solve this crisis. I think the next time we'll go out into the neighborhood and try and uh, tackle that beast. And how am I gonna solve the zombie apocalypse if I can't even make it to the bathroom? <laughs> I just pissed all over myself. The important thing is I got a mixologist. What a great day. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do leave a like. This was a fun one, I think. I think this was really fun to play. Really cool mod. Sometimes I get a mod and I'm kind of underwhelmed. This one is just really, really fun and just really well made. Uh, right off the bat. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, I appreciate you watching as always and I guess I will see you next time. Bye for now.